So, if you can create a lighting circuit, you can certainly create a switching circuit. Let's jump into Revit. Let's make sure we're all in the same view. So in the project browser, let's go to electrical, lighting, ceiling plans, level one. Let's scroll into our Office 101 and select one of your lighting fixtures. Notice that there's not a power circuit anymore. However, we still have a switch circuit available. So let's go ahead and click switch circuit. Let's click select switch and select our switch at our door. Let's click edit switch system. Add to system is already clicked on by default. Notice our switch ID is our lighting switches door. Now hover over this lighting fixture, number fixtures two. Click finish editing system. Hit escape a couple of times. Hover over your switch, hit tab. Notice that it is switched to those lighting fixtures. Let's do the same over here. Select your light, click switch, select switch, grab this one, and then we're good. We can click edit switch systems just to check it out, but now we can click on finish, hit escape, hover tab, we got it. Let's do one more. Let's select this lighting fixture, create a switch, Select switch, grab your door switch, edit switch system. Thing looks good here. Click finish editing system, hover tab. <laughs> there you go. Now we have three switch systems.